Okay, no, no, no. So, I mean, we're really excited about this space. Um, the company is growing, and we want to have a, a, a better way to present the work and to show the level of success that we're having as a company, you know, nationally. And uh, had this big mural project that just came up with the, with the library, and so I needed more space for that. But we wanted a showcase space to invite people from around the country to come to our headquarters in Columbus and see, you know, the work that we do and also meet with us about projects that we're currently working on nationally. We've got work from actually artists all around the world, but the bulk of the work that we represent is work by African-American artists that are based here in the States. And we also have some, some um, Caucasian artists that are um, artists that we represent through Black Art in America as well. So it's just a mix. It's really works that speak to the aesthetics um, of African-American culture, you know, and that's the work that we represent here at the gallery. There was really no central place where you could, you know, meet and connect online for, for artists and collectors and people in the industry. And so, you know, yeah, so it's, 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 it's special. You know, it's not, it's not every day that you can see, you know, your dream realize and be impactful uh, to so many different people. Because not only, you know, the artists and the art levels, but we have art educators around the country that use Black Art America as a resource. You know, whether they're teaching about art in the, at the high school level or at the university level, they're hearing about the stories of not only the artists that came before us, but even today's contemporary artists.